thinks he is the father of modern mankind. He also feels he's our savior. From his twisted perspective, he feels that because he genetically modified us to be what we are, that he is our father. He also feels because that he saved some of us, a remnant of his original creation here, he reestablished that here. He supposedly saved us from the flood. He considers this entire planet to be part of his empire, his illegitimate empire that he started 400,000 years ago. The information I got was from a book called Christ Consciousness by a guy named Norman Paulson. He was contacted by benevolent human extraterrestrials who told him this story about how Lucifer had ventured into some weird forbidden zone, like a black hole, and he was so badly traumatized, he and his crew, that they became insane. They went mad. That when they were in the forbidden zone, wherever that may be, and they went insane, that is when they accidentally created these mental parasites, which have various names, such as demons or archons or jinn. And those things are extremely real, they're very dangerous, and they're very prevalent in affecting our consciousness. He wants total control. He suffers from multiple personality disorders, and he also has infected himself with these mental parasites that he accidentally created. When Lucifer went mad, he made his way home back to the court of Orion. His parents said, we can't allow you to, to, to ascend to the throne because you're mentally unstable. And he said, well, then the heck with you guys. I will start my own empire. That's where the war in heaven started. Before he went mad, he was a builder of worlds. He's the one known as Enki. It's when he came here and turned this world from a paradise planet to take a contingent of human beings, upgrade them to a cyborg level through AI, and this was all by design. None of it happened by our own doing. AI is designed to control us. That's the only reason that it's being introduced now. It's been, it's ancient, it was brought here. It's worshiped in multiple religions, Israel, the Islamics, the Masonic Society, they all worship this Saturnian cube. What that is, is a hyperdimensional tesseract. It looks like a cube, but it actually is it's a portal to another dimension. That is set up on Saturn as an extension of the larger, original, mother quantum computer tesseract that Lucifer created. He created a, a matrix, a false universe. It's very small compared to the known universe, but it's where we are. Free will is a huge issue here. This is one of the reasons that he tricks us into agreeing to doing things that are not in our best interest. The reason we don't live very long here is because of his genetic modifications that he's done to us. They trick us into agreeing to come back here, and he does that to us every time we reincarnate. They reinforce their control over us by erasing our memory of the previous lifetime. So it makes us much easier to control. Evil is an infection. They have become parasitic and predatory. They feed off the negative energy that's released through our DNA when we hurt ourselves or others.